Hello guys, welcome back. I'm Julian. I'm here to do my reaction video for season four, episode six of Drake and Josh. This time the title of the episode is The Great The Honey The Honey The Honey. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how it's pronounced, uh, but we're here. We're back. We are ready for a new episode of 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 Drake and Josh. Um, previous episode, not the best episode out there, but we're gonna continue right ahead. Uh, I'm excited for for this episode as well. Drake and Josh is always funny. Most of the times, is always you know hilarious, and and you know part of it is uh, the amazing chemistry the actors have with one another and how well. They played off each other, you know. So I am, I'm excited to watch this one, uh, this episode as well. So hope you guys are excited as well uh, to watch it with me. So thumbs up if you love Drake and Josh. Subscribe, comment, hit the notification bell. Anka reaction is always posted first on Patreon in case you guys want to check that out. Link as always will be in the description down below. And for now, I think that's about it. I hope you guys enjoy. I hope you guys like it. I hope you guys continue supporting. Give a lot of hearts if you're on Patreon. And yeah, let's continue the conversation on the comment section down below. So that's about it. Thank you for watching. And let's just begin with season four, episode six of Drake and Josh. Here we go. <laughs> I'll never forget the first time I ever did a magic trick. I'll never forget the first time I ever kissed a girl. Then watch it disappear. Oh my god. Will it disappear? Maybe I should practice some more. Yeah. Maybe you should practice some more. <laughs> my wrist makes this funny sound. Oh my god. That should not be natural. That's Mr. Doheny. Yes. I I'm, I'm, I'm just such a huge fan of your magic, sir. I I Ever seen anyone do this? <laughs> I think you need therapy for that arm. I'm sort of an amateur magician myself. It's ordinary quarter and Henry's. Oh, where is the world? Oh. 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 <laughs> Consider yourself counter tricked. Ah. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> that is great. <laughs> oh. Is it? You'll get it. <laughs> <laughs> I love that she's like, you will get it. You will not complain, you will get it. Henry, hi! Hello, Josh. Now what? Now, put it back. Cough. <laughs> now, open it up. How did that win there? Is that your card? Do he oh my god! <laughs> How long have you been there? Yeah, I'm calling the cops. <laughs> the one with the onion rings? The very small. <laughs> the more the magicer. <laughs> Why are those guys wearing togas? Is that Diana Agron? Is that Diana? Uh, That's Diana Agron! Bitch, what? Oh. Would you like In a broken joke. A better one? No? No. <laughs> sure. Very well. Uh, first, I'll need. This. No, 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 please, no, no, oh, no, God. don't make her disappear. Freeney. She's in Rome. <laughs> <laughs> Where is she? Josh. Get her back. Dude, what? Your magic friend just made my date disappear. <laughs> then I'm sick of that guy always being around. Yeah, I know, he's starting to bug me too. Oh, hi, Diana. <laughs> we don't know. <laughs> I don't get it. Why can't Doheny sleep in the guest room? Cause Dad doesn't want to move his train set. Doheny head. <laughs> Doheny. Your hair is gone. <laughs> Check me out. <laughs> Honey, Mr. Doheny made me bald. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's it. Henry, Henry is in a slump, right? So? So he just needs to get back on stage and show everyone what, what, what an incredible magician he is. 
Murder is not the answer. Gentlemen, nice outfit. We are ready. What is he going to do? What did Megan told him to do? Wait, we're not killing him, right? Oh, <laughs> <yeah. laughs> Did you just murder the guy? Yes, doctor. I'm a doctor. Oh. Turn on the lights. He's dead. <laughs> are they going to prison? You're gathered here today to celebrate. Why are they not in prison? Twenty years ago, he was a complex man. He's gonna. Do he need? <laughs> That's impossible. He had no pulse. Yes, my greatest trick ever. Yes, thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's, it's even better than the transparent trouser trick. Which reminds me. Do he need? Look. Oh, my. <laughs> They're children. <laughs> it's an order. See, why... <laughs> Megan? Since you thought of the trick that put my career back on track, I think you should share in my good fortune. A check for $50,000? My God! Uh, <laughs> we helped you too, remember? Yo-yos for each of you. Yo-yos. Come, ladies. We're really? We're Las Vegas. You keep laughing at me. Yeah, it's the hair. <laughs> what about my hair? Buy a wig. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, so that was the end of season four, episode six of Drake and Josh. Another fun, fun episode. Um, I really enjoyed it. I really enjoyed it. I think it was funny. It was, um, I mean, inappropriate jokes that I think as adults, you know, we, we of course, we see it and we are like, how did they let it they let s such jokes uh uh be part of a kids show um i understand that you know but then there are s certain other aspects uh, uh of the show that is actually they're actually you know very uh fu funny so they find this uh well yeah they encounter this uh magician that uh Josh and Josh's dad are huge fans of right but the guy's a magician but uh nothing has happened in his career for the past 10 years um and as josh he is very much into magic and magic tricks and so he goes around doing magic tricks all the time you know so at one point he kind of gets a little bit tiring you know even for josh who is such a big fan of magic it gets tiring for him to be like you know okay you, you need to stop you know so <laughs> for me that was funny I think that was that, that was hilarious um um and of course I was like kind of like uh 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 annoying I'm not a huge f fan of magic tricks I mean one maybe two it's fine but like by the third fourth I'm like kind of like okay shut up do something else <laughs> you know <laughs> um so uh megan actually thinks of an uh, has an idea for a trick that no one has done before which is uh doing the magic trick of putting the swords toward toward not towards uh yeah through the uh coffin right and that will result with then taking the swords out and the person will be alive or will be in a completely different place uh but ne megan the mastermind that she is she took it a, a step uh uh further and she actually um you know made th this whole thing about oh no he's actually dead you know and actually a doctor declare him dead and i'm like okay if he's dead, isn't there an event investigation going on where these two young children, <laughs> you know, young uh, 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 teenager teenagers, 
might have killed this old man? Apparently not. Apparently they were excused of, uh, uh, about it, you know? And, and they were like, oh, you kill a magician. Oh, it happens every single week. It's fine. Go home, you know? <laughs> like, like, they were at the funeral, you know what I mean? So, and they never got arrested, I think, for it. And thankfully, because then uh, uh, in, in his funeral, he gets to get get the big reveal and everybody's like oh my god but he was actually dead and now he's alive and like he came back from the dead and like it was a huge thing that landed him a deal with uh something in La in Las Vegas uh where he's going to be paid 4 million dollars uh for a 5 year stay there so he has job security he has money now you know and it's it's all thanks to Megan, who gets a big reward for it. $50,000. I, 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 I have never seen that amount of, of money in my life, you know? And there goes Megan helping a magician do something that will grant him $4 million and then a commission for her of $15,000. Which I think is little, but still, you know? Um, and... Josh and Drake, who were helping him, he was sleeping in his in their room and all of that, and they were, you know, just having to deal with the fact that he's snore and everything. They got yo-yos. <laughs> uh, I lo I love the fact that Megan did got something out of this, a bunny also, and uh, 50k, um, and the other two <laughs> just got yo-yos, you know. That was hilarious. Let's be real. It was hilarious. Um, but yeah, she got the career of this man up and running. And also, we have Diane Angron on this episode. Which is like, what? I did not knew she was in an episode of Drake and Josh. Uh, and let alone on this one. So it was, it was cute seeing her. She's so young. I mean, she was very young as well when she was on Glee. But, like, she's even younger here, so it was so cute seeing her. I had the biggest crush on Diana. Uh, I still do, you know, because the woman is incredible, you know, uh, and gorgeous, you know. But, like, this is her when she was a teenager, probably. I don't know how old she was here. But, you know, Diane, Diana A. Grown, her Glee era and after her Glee era, she's just beautiful. She's she's a dream come true, you know. So, um, yeah, it was great seeing her here. So, and of course, Drake was gonna be d dating someone else, and completely forgot about the girl that she was he was dating on the previous episode because it's Drake. Um, but yeah, anyways, great episode, loved it. Hope you guys enjoyed it as well. Thumbs up if you love Drake and Josh. Subscribe, comment, hit notification bell. Uncut reaction is always posted first on Patreon. Thank you for watching. Thank you for all your support. You guys are incredible. Hope you enjoy. And that's it. With uh, that's it. That's it. Not not without further nothing. That's it. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time for more reaction videos for Drake and Josh. I'll see you guys next time. Mwah. Bye guys.